Boys, how you been? Nice day out in Inwoods today. Not too bad, Gio. Nice and bright and sunny, but totally freezing this frig out cold out. So it's just splendid for painting. Eh? But, uh, yeah. Having me a absolute frig of a time finding uh, the lub nups I need. Just diabolical. I would have never guessed. Never friggin' guessed in my wildest dreams. So, I, uh, I gotta get this done. I can't, you know, just sit around and, and, and wait and hope that, uh, you know, lug nuts are gonna magically appear. So I gotta rip all this off, put the friggin' original tires back on wherever they are outside. Over here, put the original tires back on and get it off the hoist. Cause A, I gotta friggin' uh, Phipps the starter in the old lady's van, so I gotta somehow figure out how to get it up onto the hoist. And L, we gotta get this truck painted today because it's gonna be thunder dunder tomorrow and the next day and then the weather always changes, so I'm sure it'll be thunder dunder for the next couple days and it's not thunder dunder right now. So right now is when we need to uh, get this uh, get this truck painted and that's just, uh, just the way it is so hopefully the freezing or spring out cold out weather really allowances onto the uh, paint drying accord and it'll be just friggin awesome here's frig but anyways boys with any luck we'll get this painted and uh, the lug nuts will show up this afternoon and the last two days was just in customs <gasps> beg my pardon While I wrap the tape around some stuff, I'm just going to pop the tail lights out, probably be easier. And we'll just uh, quickly go over the bumpers. Yeah, not too bad. Tires, bumpers, a little more paper, windshield, piece of friggin' peeny. But uh, the old lady made some hop chop lips. It's friggin' freezing this cold, so it'll be tasty in my belly. Plus we'll have a cigarette, and it's because it's break time. Oh dick, we just had a little drive-by. Had a little drive-by. Ready as we'll ever be. Well, I've done better jobs painting stuff, but it's a mud truck and it's windier as frig out. Eh? But check that out. Oh, mother lord. Ran out of paint. So now I gotta go get a little bit more. Probably give her a whole once over. Just grab another 
half a tin or something and just give it a swig. Look at that. What's really going on? I'm going no good. But any words, I don't know why I thought I had enough. I do have some A and B paint, some like freaking two part epoxy, but I can only find the, the actual color, not the stove pipe, like the A, not the B, right? So, oh, mother lard, but we're getting there, eh? Freaking part stick dropped off the, the lub up, so we'll be able to uh, put the spacers on now. We're just waiting for very similar lob nups. Uh, see how you can put them on that way and it's flat, or you put them on that way and it's at the tapir. So we'll put the ones like this on the tape, and then the bigger ones, the 14 by 1.5s, on with the flat side down to just hold the rim copacetic. But, anyways, boys, holy suffering. We'll get that uh, bullshit done. We'll slap the rims and tires back onto it. I'm gonna see if I can't get the old lady's rig up on the hoist too. Son of a bitch. Well, I ran out of paint, so I had to go get a little bit more. Hide your weed needers. Hide your freaking weed needers, eh? He's scoping up weed needers. You can tell. Frick sakes. But uh, hey, it's boys. We're just gonna shoot to town quick. Grab some freaking paint. We need to literally squirt the truck two more times, maybe three. But I'm going to buy a whole gallon and just do the whole truck over again. Make sure we get a good application on. I suppose, maybe, hopefully, whatever uh, paint we get is copacetic with what we've been using. But I guess we won't know until we get back and start squirting it on the truck. So, anyways, boys. Well, boys, I really appreciate the uh, the RZ mask. Where's the decal? Where's the friggin' decal? RZmask.com! Friggin' right. I painted a friggin' truck and I was still able to, to breathe. Of course, I, I got asphyxiated before I actually put the mask on. Inwood Customs, beg my pardon, but ended up having to finish her off a little trim cut gas. Woo! But uh, yeah, RZ mask. Mucho good a one. Pretty story valve wide open in that accord, but uh, let's go have a look. The uh, paint that I started with ran out. It was the good kind. And then we ended up having to go spend 60 bucks. Well, with the, with the freaking gas, it was like 80 bucks. But uh, yeah, looks freaking mint. Oh my god, eh? That looks sharper as frig. It does. But, uh, anyways, all I gotta do now is unmask her, put the friggin' wheels onto it, do a little bit of stencil action so everybody knows, one back up a cam, and then figure out a way to get the old lady's uh, van on the hoist. Great, great, and I think Monopoly Man's coming down to get some grease and done on his friggin' uh, RV too. Hope you're friggin' happy, eh? Hope you're friggin' happy, boys. But, uh, anyways, look at the mess. Everything with the old paint, good. I don't know, the trim clad's just so thick. You gotta like thin it out three quarters thinner to a quarter friggin... Uh, you got about 10% of trim clad and about three quarters gas. What happened? But, uh, yeah, so, anyways, that's the story. I'm sticking to it. Well, it's been a long day, but we freaking got her, boys. Freaking rates we did, just ripping the wheels off this and that, but it's so much or something, so I'll be right back. We'll get these freaking wheels on there finally. Oh, mother lard, please. Please have the right lob nups. He says they're the right lob nups, boys.
Well, I had to turn it around in the oven because uh, this side's still totally wet as frig, so hopefully a little bit of the uvuletic rays from the sunshine will uh, scope it ties down onward and cure the paint, but uh, yeah, finally, eh? Holy, this was quite the process, eh? Look at that. Oh, lard. My poor grass in different area. <gasps> You bessent, eh? Uh, oh, goodness gracious. But, uh, yeah, the paint's still pretty tacky, so I don't want to, you know, go messing with it with the stencils and then end up racking it de in the customs. Plus, it's windy as frig, and I don't want a bunch of overspray all over everything. So, we're just going to wait. We're going to wait, like real boys. But, uh, yeah, I'm super happy with this. I just want it to stand out, you know what I mean? I don't want it to be like every other deco. I just bought a truck, it's four-wheel drive, and drove it to friggin' Mudfist. Yeah, that's what we did last year. A lot of it probably has to do with the driving, not so much as the vehicle, but you know what I'm saying? I think, uh, I think we'll, we'll do good in this. It's just testing out four high and four low and different things, so all that nonsense appears to be working. We'll have to chuck it up on the hoist, uh, at some point fix the exhaust leak because it's dumping right out on the transfer case. What? Oh, there's a there's exhaust uh, cigarette right there. That's probably where, where the hole's from. But uh, yeah, we got full torque on the wheels and uh, no rubby rubby. Perfect. Couldn't couldn't ask for a better setup for a for mud festipini. There maybe a little bit of the overspray in the windshield could have been avoided there but uh hey i'm one dick what do you want oh my goodness that was tampered with but anyways boys if you guys are going to mud mammoth friggin uh santa says out maybe we'll we'll have a spaspy can and a cheech oh i'll get onto the other side so you can really santa says i think the uh the stencils and everything the inward customs and the plants and this and that really really set it off but uh they won't, they won't be able to miss me until we get covered in mud and then it'll be the same as every other truck. But once we, when we first get there, eh, it'll be pretty awesome. Pretty friggin' happy with this, boys. But anyways, boys, let me know what you think. Friggin' figure Fotch get that like button there. A couple of itches from earlier in the week, but uh, anyways, there you go, another dick of a bomb button. Talk to them out. Talk to the get you.